Welcome to Threadline Stadium here in New York, home of the Tyrants. Boy, they really cleaned up Times Square, huh? I kind of miss the sea of wandering zombies and the stench of the open zombie landfills. And they had this nice all-you-could-shoot zombies in a barrel arcade, I remember. Yeah, that was in a good old days, Grim. Now it's just a tourist attraction. Paint shows and organized crime. <laughs> Today's matchup is going to be a good one. The teams take the field. The Leland Burns take on the New York Tyrants. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Hey, you see that move, baby? No, you didn't. You know why? I'm too fast for you. I'm the greatest. The greatest, I tell you. <laughs> if the sound of a torn Achilles followed by laughter and taunting brings a smile to your face, you are attuned to the right place. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitzrow and the MFL crew is coming to you live on game day. Bricks, any uh, thoughts on today's game? Um, I thought I had one, but uh, I think I might have forgotten it. Oh, I remember. Uh, I forgot who's playing today. Careful what you ask for, Grim. And that's how you run the football. A pickup of seven on the play. Grim, why is it that more mentally disturbed clowns don't play football? They'd be good. You know, they're all in politics, apparently. First and ten. It looks like the defense has it on Schmidt. Oh, and he intercepts the ball. Oh, he was hitting mid hurl and fumbles the ball. He could go all the way. He's leaving a wake of destruction in his path. Oh, sure, now he catches it. I had this guy on my fantasy team. Bingo, bingo. I just hit that mutant bingo. And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays. Talk about luck. And it's first and ten. on that one and he was just starting to pick up some speed oh and the late hit arrives right on time when it's your time to go it's your time and it's first and ten functioning brain cells before that hit they're gone oh and you can bury that guy because he is dead oh did you see what number he was i gotta check it off my dead mutant bingo card i only need one more and it's first and ten <laughs> at this rate the qb is going to have more interceptions than completions oh devastating hit you ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Hey, man. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, but it was just a regular knuckles. And it's first and ten. <laughs> Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. <laughs> Second down and six. Third down and long. here and I'm not 
not talking about the corned beef with extra mayo. Third down in the offense, and the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Third down and never going to happen. That's a nice catch for five yards. Hey, man, nobody can touch you when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, pop? Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. Man, it's on big stands. He got hit by a cop. This guy's a brick shit. Man, what a hit. Talk about a guy's career blowing up. Okay, that guy's career just blew up. Uh, along with most of his skeleton. He was being rhetorical, you moron. You don't think I don't know what rhetorical is, huh? Well, I do. Someone please tell me. And it's first and ten. And he punched his way out of that tack. That's the way to move the chains. That's good for a first down. Oh, holy smokes. He just killed that player with a cheap shot. That's why we love the NFL. And it's first and ten. He might have managed to dig out a yard on that one. Not my yard. Got too much buried in, you know, the usual money, bodies, coffee cans filled with, well, uh, you know, mostly coffee. Tastes better, like Eskimos burying salmon heads, kimchi. I'm not in anything really tastes good. I don't know whose eyes the QB is using, but can we get him some new ones? Send a message for that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. And it's first and ten. That's a four yard gain. Second down and six. And that's the kind of play you pay the secondary for. Yep. It looks like we've got a penalty here. First and ten. And there's another pick. Man, this quarterback must have learned a lot about sharing when he was in school. Yeah, that's why he's so popular. Oh, mama, he just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. ran into the line at the DMV. And guess what, Grim? That line ain't moving. Yeah, that was kind of my point, Bricks. Second down and ten. Oh, 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 oh. oh what the brutal... Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. And it's first and ten. Oh, now the offense 
Lance is getting kills. Ah, uh, this is a really violent game, guys. It's fantastic. <laughs> Second down and seven. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw it. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. He's at the ball. Somebody get that guy a beer, because he just saved me a thousand. Football is a team sport, and that's why you should never think about mine unless it's that kind. The fans are looking a bit bored. After a quarter with no score, they're cheering on the refs. <laughs> At least someone's moving the ball. And it's first and ten. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And that'll be second down and four. Now the offense is getting kills. This is really a violent game, guys. And it's first and ten. Quarterback threads the needle for a first down. Oh, man, he just went off the rails of a crazy train and murdered that guy. Gotta love it. He should bite his head off for an encore, Grim. First down and one. Second down and four. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. These aren't just regular aliens. They are criminal aliens. And they have a lot of moves besides dancing. And the refs better check the wallets. Don't want to make any mistakes here. Just kick the ball through the upright, for God's sake. Straight through the uprights. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. He's like a monkey trying to fuck a grease football. He gets away in a hurry. Oh, nice hit. And it's first and ten. They've called his half attack. The oh, he took a leap and hit the ball, knocked out. Fumble. He's got a case of fumbleitis. He's at the ten. He did it. He scores. And with that amazing run, he bursts through the end zone for six. <laughs> Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Unstoppable force meets the explodable object. Oh, what a hit. Hey, Bricks, what does it feel like to get hit like that? Uh, like being... The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably grabbed his pants.
And it's first and ten. And that'll be a few to jump over those mines are still. Bingo! Bingo! I just hit that mutant bingo! And all I was missing was his number for the last three plays! Talk about luck! Is down to their last running back. When he bites the dust, they can only pass. Yeah, well, at least they don't have to forfeit them. That's right, but now the defense can focus on killing the receivers. First down and three. And they stack the line, and he gets his bell rung for a yard. Second down and two. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! See that move, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that. <laughs> and they line up for the extra point. Straight through the uprights. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned out the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. Nothing out of it. Second down and ten. Oh man, I love this dirty trick. The quarterback unleashes a run. He broke free and has open field in front of him. He's at the 30. Boom, and he's dead. step up his game not only did he step up there he blew up <laughs> nice extra effort and it's first and ten and that's the way to get the sticks moving he picks up five yards on that play Second down and five. The defender is one feet up to take And he runs it for four yards. And that'll bring up third and one. Taking you with me. Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. You know, sometimes the best thing to do is just punt and let your defense get the ball back. 
And he put all of his foot into that one. And he just lets that one go. He says, no, thank you. And the defense downs it. The New York Tyrants bash the opposition into nothingness and walk away with a win by forfeit. There's not much left of the opposition, and the fans are loving it. There was only one way this game was going to end, and that was in a forfeit. That's not quite true, Grim. An alien spacecraft could have crashed into the stadium and ended the game, too. Oh, 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 well, how about it? You know what? Rhinoceros. You know what? Take your medication and sit down. Let's go down to the field and hear what the MVP has to say. Don't expect too much, folks. Garbage in, garbage out, you know? They don't call them garbage barge for nothing. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right.